Well, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. A very warm welcome to the Café Royale in the city of Westminster. Well, on behalf of James and Luke, I'd like to welcome all of you here today to share with them in this, their wedding ceremony. And through their vows, they are making a commitment to each other. And through your presence here, you are expressing your support for them. The guy who never forgets your birthday, your anniversary or special moment. He's a basically a man full of love for all of his friends and family. I'd like to say he knows by the look on my face or just a tone in a text, something's up or I have something exciting to say. His loyalty to our friendship has never faltered. A moment for us is a time when you look around you absorb everything, all the senses, the sights, the sounds, the smells, the moment. The happy moment, sitting on a balcony in Italy, drinking beer, with sun in our faces, listening to Andrea Pacilli. In fits of laughter, I still no idea why we were laughing, and the barbecue was lit, ready to go. It's just a great moment. Or simply the moment, Nonna, Oliver, Uncle James and Luke were dancing in my kitchen to, on a Sunday night to Zorg the Greek after drinking far too much wine. Far too many moments to go through. 20 years of friendship. 20 years, 20 years it took me to show you how to light a barbecue. <laughs> but we got cooking in the end, mate and many more years and barbecues to come. We've been through a lot, and our journey together has only got started. Simply love the good moments, and remember and cherish them, as life is far too precious. As someone close to me said, all you need to do is love each other. It's that simple. you laugh at least once, causes you to think twice, and if he admits to being human and making mistakes, hold on to him and give him the most that you can. He isn't going to quote poetry, he's not thinking about you every moment, but he will give you a part of him that he knows you could break. Don't hurt him and don't change him. And don't expect for more than he can give. And don't analyse. Smile when he makes you happy. 
yell when he makes you mad and miss him when he's not there. Love hard when there is love to be had because perfect guys don't exist but there's always one guy that is perfect for you. James, do you take Luke to be your husband? I do. do you... Oops, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be quiet. But he's keen. Yeah. Yes. Did you read this? No. Yeah. no. Do you... <laughs> I do, I do, I do, I do, I do. It's too hot, it is. I was going to say, do, do you promise to comfort him in life's sorrow and pain, to rejoice with him through good times, and to remain true to him for the rest of your lives together? I do. Yeah. You got it twice there. Yes, doubles. Now, Luke, do you take James to be your husband? Do you promise to comfort him in life's sorrow and pain, to rejoice with him through the good times, and to remain true to him for the rest of your lives together? I do. You changed my world. I said I love you, and my, my life felt complete when you said it too. Life's now fun that we've really begun. The legwork was over. Let's go buy a sofa. Building a home, being as one. You were best friend and boyfriend, all rolled into one. What tops this completeness, you can decide. A train track, a piano, and a ring by your side. This can't be true, it's all eyes on you. Comfort zone behind you, fear in front. Closing the deal would need a big shunt. Yes, I said as I wiped the tears from my eyes. This man makes me feel so special inside. The planning had started, let's bring on the fun. A magical day with all our loved ones. So I'm standing here now, right by your side, to have and to hold till death do us part, my husband to be the very centre of my heart. Love you now, always and forever, your bear. I call upon these persons here present. These persons here present. To witness that I, James. To witness that I, James. Do take thee, Luke. Take thee, Luke. To be my lawful wedded husband. To be my lawful wedded husband. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. For the rest of our lives together. For the rest of our lives together. I call upon these persons here present. These persons here present. To witness that I, Luke. To witness that I, Luke. Do take thee, James. Do take thee, James. To be my lawful wedded husband. To be my lawful wedded husband. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. For the rest of our lives together. For the rest of our lives together. Luke, I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. All that I am, I give to you. All that I am, I give to you. All that I have, I share. All that I have, I share with you. James, I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. All that I am, I give to you. All that I am, I give to you. All that I have, I share with you. All that I have, I share with you. So on behalf of the City of Westminster, it gives me great pleasure to declare that you are now legally married. Congratulations, you make it.
place and I met Luke, and I felt you gave me life. You brought a, f a freshness to my being, the fun we would have, the laughter we had just being together. And knowing that you wanted to spend as much time with me as I did with you was like being my new best friend. You, Luke Golson, even to this day, really do make me feel brand new. I may moan and grumble I don't get to spend as much time with you as I'd like, but we all know what a family orientated, caring and driven individual you are, and I wouldn't want you to ever change. You're inspirational, Luke, in everything you do, and I'm so proud of what you've achieved to date and continue to do so. I love that still after I spend the day with you, I can smell your aftershave on my clothes, and I love that you're the last person I talk to before I go to sleep, and the first person I'll see when I wake up. When you realise you want to spend the rest of your life with somebody, you want the rest of your life to start as soon as possible. Ladies and gentlemen, please be upstanding and raise your glasses to my husband, my best friend, and the one I want whom I want to start my next chapter with, Luke Golson. When I first met James, I really did fall for him straight away. He made me laugh, he made me smile, he made me cry, <laughs> and feel things about someone in some ways which I never really felt before from Tony. James totally turned my world upside down. I chased him when we met, so he had to close the deal. I truly didn't believe in my wildest dreams he would do something like that. James hates being in the limelight and being the centre of attention. James doesn't even like opening gifts in front of people as he gets so shy. So when people ask me about that, that day, the proposal day, I truly didn't believe he would put himself out there like that. There's one particular line at the end of The Greatest Showman, which I'm sure most people here have seen. And when James and I went to the cinema, it, it seemed to just stick with me and I loved it. And it sums up just how I feel about James. It's everything you ever want. It's everything you ever need. And it's here in front of you. This is where I wanna be.